Hey guys, bonjour tout le monde. So how's it going? I'll wait for a few people to come on. In the meantime, I got some new storage pieces today. So in order to show them to you, I'm pulling out some old stock. So bonjour tout le monde. Hi Suzanne. Hello Lise. Bonjour Marie's. So, hi Victoria and Pauline. So nice to see everybody. I'm not, hi Fred, I, I, bonjour Laura. I'm not in as huge a rush today. My next meeting's at five, so I should be good. Hi Ariel, hello Guilherme. All right. Bonjour, Pauline, Jacinthe. Hi, Diane. Bonjour, Odette. All right, guys. I am, before I show all this storage stuff, I am, hi, Heather. Hi, Pamela. Karen. Hi, everybody. All right. I, I am going to show you some new ATCs, firstly. Look how cute. Okay, who brought these in? Oh, these, that's right, Michelle sent these in. So thank you, Michelle. And Deidre brought these in. Aren't they beautiful? This is a My Besties stamp. I loved My Besties. I love the big eyes. Not everybody loves the big eyes. I do. And I think they are so cute. And she colored them in all different color overalls. Avec the uh, different color bandanas on her head. Really, really cute, Deidre. Good job. Love them. Hello, Martine. No, t'es pas la... Oh, est-ce que t'es la seule? Des fois, c'est votre inter internet. Des fois, c'est moi. Okay. I don't know why you guys are cutting so much because it's really not cutting here. So I know when it's my problem because it cuts the video as well, but it's not cutting. So I don't know what's going on. All right. So I do have a bunch of new stuff to show you, but before we do that, let me show you a couple um, of classes I got to take. So here, this was done by with Graphic 45. Now, these are all paper flowers. I inked them a little too pink. I was kind of matching it to this, and I think I went a little too dark for the paper. But let that be the worst of the problems. So you guys remember on Graphic 45, a déjà sorti un album comme ça en craft. Maintenant, il sort une en ivoire. So you guys, a bunch of you bought the craft album like this. Well, now we've just done one. They, they brought one out in ivory. Donc, ça vient déjà avec la pochette. Ça vient déjà ici avec cette pochette-là. Puis nous autres, on a mis quelque chose en dedans. So we put something right in the middle of it. Okay. Which is very cute. Let's see if I can slide it back in one-handed. Uh, yeah, there was, um, I, well, I took a bunch of classes and then there were some that I haven't gotten to finish because they were overzealous. So you see this, this one here, and then look how cute. Et ça vient déjà comme ça. Okay, so it already comes with the waterfall. Ça vient avec des aimants déjà the dent. So all of this is already done, sauf le papier décoratif. Donc, il va être toute vierge en ivoire et ils ont fait une en noir aussi. So they made the ivory one and they made a black one. So black craft and ivory now for the waterfall albums. So again, we just papered it. 
So lots of fun. It was a fun little class. It was quick to do. So, and then we put a pocket on the back here. Oops, I think this gets folded in and then this, and then that. And there's a magnet here, donc ça reste fermé. Okay, so very cute little album. Now, I showed you guys the other day this one. Well, here's the same stamp used again. Okay, so you can see how different it can look. This is screaming your name, Dominic. Vraiment. So, beautiful, beautiful stamp set. And look how different it looks once colored. So, really nice. Pour la foil. Je vous montrer ça l'autre jour. So, I showed this one off the other day. So, this is with a foiling plate and a stencil. Okay? Now, I want you to see how perfectly... How do I describe this without tooting my own horn? The inks. When I was putting this, donc chacune de ceux-là s'est fait avec des encres. Et j'ai utilisé différentes encres dépendant la couleur que j'ai voulu. But I can tell you that it is amazing how smooth they dried. Okay, parce que quand je l'ai fait, j'ai trouvé comme un peu blotchy. Puis quand ça sèche, a look how it just looks like I took patterned paper and put it in there. So I really was impressed with how these inks dried. And I'm pretty sure what I used was a mixture of Pink Fresh. Je veux dire Pink Fresh and Hero Arts. I think I used some of those. Okay. And I think this might have been cracked pistachio, but I'm not sure. Okay. So there's that. Then here's the same thing done with the different colors, a pas de foil. So this is again stenciled, different colors, but no foil. So they are really, really beautiful. So those are coming. This was that beautiful embossing powder I was showing you. Ça c'est pas ici au mama, mais c'est juste pour vous montrer un style de les nouveaux poudres qui s'en vient. So this is not in stock, okay? So these were just a few projects that I showed the other day, but if you missed the video, I'm just gonna quickly zip through them. This one, the gold in the background, guys, you, are guy, you guys are gonna love. They are vivid colors in an airless mister, and they just go on so beautifully. And this is just, um, it wasn't chipboard. It was like a piece of MDF that we painted. Okay. So beautiful. Uh, we'll look at Ariel's cards in a minute. I think I showed you guys this, the paper hug. Okay. Ça, c'est une matrice faite par um, Picket Fence. Donc, ça coupe le morceau de plastique qu'on a utilisé ici. Et ça, c'est juste un morceau de packaging qu'on a utilisé, puis um, on était supposé de faire un slimline en cette version-là. This was supposed to say, I miss your face, I miss your face, I miss your face, but we accidentally got this as a paper hug, so we just layered those, and it was just a lot of fun to make this simple shaker card. This one was nice and techniquey. So this one, avec le cire et avec les poudres clair, very nice. Here's the piece I cut off of my card. Okay. Ça, c'est le morceau qu'on a découpé de la carte. Puis un de nos amis, dans le cours, a pris, a pris l'autre morceau. Puis elle a mis au, en dedans comme un petit pochette pour un carte cadeau. So one of the girls in the class, she suggested cut, once you cut that off, glue it on the inside and stick a gift card in there. So that's great. That was a wonderful idea. Thank you, Sherry. And then I showed you last week these beautiful cards we did with Wendy Vecchi. So things like that. So these are some of the items. Now I still have more. Um... 
Et les autres étaient faites par quelques-uns par moi, puis quelques-uns par Francine. So, the, this was a Spellbinders class. How cute is that? Okay. Now, moi, envoie l'alphabet toujours. Mais ça n'a même pas rentré dans la tête que quand on met notre alphabet en ordre, que le mot « hi » est déjà là. Right? So, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, and it takes just somebody to realize that the word hi is right in the middle there. So, I thought that was really cool. So, look how nice that alphabet is. I will tell you, the die is a little tricky, okay? Donc, il faut avoir la patience. C'est pas que ça coupe pas, ça coupe facilement. C'est de savoir laquelle est le B, puis laquelle est le P, des choses comme ça, ça a pris juste un peu de temps. Et ce que je suggère, dès que vous découvrez laquelle lettre est laquelle, de prendre un Sharpie, puis écrire sur le métal laquelle lettre est laquelle. So what I would do is, I would, uh, once you decipher which letter is which, I would write on the back of the die exactly which is which, and that way you'll always know. So that one was beautiful and so simple. And look at that background. It's not a pluie de gaufrage. So one day I will show that to you. It's a simple background. Then this one is courtesy of Francine. Elle était en train de um, préparer une cour pendant que je suis une autre. Et le plus amusant est que elle a commencé avec une carte, puis la dame a commencé avec une autre. So, Francine was helping me prep for this class. So, she cut up everything for this one, and she put this together right away. And then she cut everything for, hmm, there was another one. Anyways, that is not the order that the woman did them in. She did the lemon card first, and then she... So, I was always one card behind, okay? So, look at this. Donc, quand tu le fais découper ça, tu l'as aussi chacun des morceaux, comme dans le rouge foncé, tu vas avoir le thé. Donc, ce qu'elle a fait pendant que qu'elle a coupé, elle a gardé les deux morceaux. So you see how you have the thanks up there? C'est complètement l'opposé. So it's the opposite. So if you keep your letters, you can make two cards out of the one cut. And then there was discussion over whether they liked the black U or the gold U better. So The class said to use the black U, but we ended up liking the gold one better. And then these are just some beautiful rhinestones glued down. Okay? Donc, vraiment facile à faire. J'ai gardé la matrice proche pour vous montrer, mais je l'ai perdu. All right, I did want to show you what the die looked like, but I will after. Now, this was a make and take. Ça, c'était um, un projet, un mini projet qu'on a fait. Okay, so Francine did this one up quickly for us. And do you see that background? C'est un nouveau pliwal de gaufrage, le fond. Ça, c'est beau. Mais quand vous voyez comme ça, c'est encore plus beau. So I was like, who's going to want lemon dyes? And then you see this, and it's like, wow. Okay? So very, very cool. Um, simple card, slimline. The happy birthday is a sentiment. Ça, c'est à quoi ça l'air, le nouveau pliwal de gaufrage. And what's nice about Spellbinders' new embossing folders, they are um, a full... Five by seven or six by eight? I think it's six by eight. Okay. Really, really, really nice. Next, I'm going to show you the die. Now that's me. So here, that's the thank you die. Okay. 
So that's what it looks like. This is the embossing folder. Donc c'est 5.5 x 8.5. Donc bonne pour les 5 par 7 pour les slimline et pour une A2. Okay? So beautiful, beautiful. And then the sentiment set. Hang on. You don't need to see my garbage and my messy desk, but that is the sentiment. Okay? Que on a mis sur la carte avec les citrons. So, really, really nice. So, there they go. There it is. It was this, which was a layout class from Simple Stories. Look how pretty that comes out. So, this is their new line called The Good Stuff. Je pense qu'on l'a reçu en 12-12. Où c'est en route? It might be... Uh, on its way here. So beautiful, beautiful, three pages done. And it, it reconnect, we reconnected. Sorry, guys. Okay, I'm here. So this is one of the Simple Stories um, page templates. And what I was told by even Francine and some other people est que sans utiliser ça la première fois, vous comprenez pas exactement à quoi ça, qu'est-ce qu'il fait. So people were saying, until you actually sit down and use it, you don't fully understand how it gives you your perfect squares and the perfect spacing and you know that you can get that many pictures on one page if you need to. So that was what Francine found the most fascinating about this, okay, was using that stencil. And you see, you don't have to make it with all the squares. Il faut pas faire size carré, mais une adaptation, adaptation de la pochoir elle-même. Ça vous donne exactement un bon placement, bon espace, tout placé très, très bien. So that's what those stencils are for, okay? We do have a few of them on the website. So that is a beautiful line. So you saw lots there that I did. Some will go back and visit at different times. We're going to have a quick peek at some Ariel um, cards that she brought in to me today. So this one is Lan Fawn, You Are Sublime. Okay. Then this is The Scent with Love. Et aussi, elle a utilisé le pochoir des cœurs de Lan Fawn en arrière. So this one is Scent with Love and Lots of Hearts background. Very, very pretty. Love it. Love the colors. Now this is probably also Scent with Love. And she used the heart background, sent with love, sent with love, quilted heart backdrop, okay? The only thing I don't know is, uh, Ariel, you said you used the slimline ATC window die set. J'ai pas 100% certain où. So she said she used the window die set, and I'm just wondering where. So I think that might be where she stamped the I love you. That was, would be the smallest um, rectangle in there. Then we've got this one here that's a shaker. And that looks like a Sizzix, Tim Holtz. Yeah, Tim's heartbeat die. Then this one, Ankar, sent with love. And each one of those flaps lift up. And underneath she used the heart stencil. Donc, uh, pour son fond en, en dessous de les peekaboo. Elle a utilisé le pochoir aussi pour les cœurs. And then the, she has the little moufettes in there as well. Okay? So, very, very, very cute. And last but not least, the big XOXO qui est bilingue. Et encore le scent with love. So great cards, Ariel. Thank you for sharing them with us. Now, we've talked lately about a lot of organization. 
Well, one of the classes I took this week was with um, Tiffany from Totally Tiffany. Et Totally Tiffany, c'est toutes les, ran- les choses de rangement qu'on a déjà utilisé. So that's Totally Tiffany. But for people who don't want to just organize their desk, they want to organize all their supplies, that's what these are for. So let's just take a quick peek. This is the number six, numéro six. Il vient dans un paquet, trois dans le paquet, okay? So you get three in the package, and this is what they're going to look like on your desk, sur votre rangement, okay? So the number six can also hold a paper trimmer. It, here I've got some organizational pockets. This is another piece. Ça, c'est une autre qui s'appelle the Edna bag. Where's the packaging from the Edna bag? Okay, and that holds ribbon and or. <clears throat> so, ça fait pour les rubins ou les stickles ou les um, anc de stress. Puis, elle suggère de mettre un, un collant avec le nom de la couleur dessus. Okay? So, the way it opens... Let's see. Jay, I might need you to hold this a sec. I do like the Totally Tiffany. Okay? So, this... Oui, ça, c'est une pochette pochette en plastique, mais il y a aussi un continent en dents. Okay, so it does come with a container. So that is what keeps it formed. Okay, and then you can just keep them, all your colors, let's say you did your cold colors, your warm colors, you could, if you wanted to, put them in there and have them all arranged in there. I say that's a bit of a waste of space. I would put my trimmer in there. I would put uh, my, maybe my big shot plates, stuff like that. So that would be number six, s'appelle numéro six. Numéro cinq est celui-là, okay, number five. And again, it can hold 12 by 12, so it goes 12 inches deep, so it can hold 12 by 12 of anything. I just put in my mini ink pad, trays in here just to show you, but it can hold a lot. So, six, cinq. Voilà le numéro quatre, puis ça c'est toute mon ligne doodle bug que peut-être je vais vous montrer. Voilà le numéro trois. Donc, celui-là, il pleut mince et uh, mais encore haut. So, again, you can just put and arrange, you can arrange a whole page kit in here. You can separate, oh, oh, that wasn't smart. You can separate um, your scraps in there if you want. I'm going to pick up my mess. And then number two, le numéro deux, il tient comme toutes les bouteilles. Donc, imagine, au lieu d'avoir tout dans un tiroir ou quelque chose, vous pouvez avoir trois ou quatre comme ça qui sont minces. Mais si tu veux comme un spray bleu, puis tu mets tous tes bleus et mauves dans un paquet, you just pull this out and you would go and use it. When you're done, slide it back in on your shelf. So that is for people who want to put things away. Okay, sorry guys. Ça c'est pour les, les personnes qui aiment serrer des choses. Donc, je peux pas chaque jour utiliser les sprays. Donc, à ce temps-là, dans un, un cabinet ou quelque chose, vous pouvez mettre des rangements comme ça. And then this is the number one. And this holds all your mini sprays, your dilution shimmer sprays, your uh, pixie sparkles. So really can hold a little bit of anything. And again, it's just so that you can label it, pull it out, put it away at the end, and you are done. I know, Karen, I'm right there with you. So, numéro 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, puis 1. Each one comes with three in a package, okay? So, like the number one, 
you will get three in the package that look exactly like this, okay? And they are quite sturdy. And like I said, Totally Tiffany was all built on this. So obviously she knows her arrangement. So <clears throat> each one of her bags, yet the utilisation différent. Elle, elle fait des suggestions toujours différentes. Donc, comme ceux-là, pour les rouleaux de Robin, ou les hanques de Tim, ou les stickles. Puis, elle vous montre tous les sacs différents que vous pouvez avoir. OK? So, she shows you all these different bags. So, she has one small enough that you can put washi tape rolls. She has... Um, I'll go grab the pen one in a minute. This one is called the Denise Buddy Bag. Et vous, vous pouvez utiliser avec trois pochettes, uh, trois pochettes, trois pochettes comme ça. Ou vous pouvez ranger des uh, foam stamps, les, les petits étampes, des choses comme ça. Puis encore, tu reçois la sac et trois pochettes pour aller ou um, pas pochette. What's the word for that? Continent. Trois continents comparables qui fêteraient dedans. Okay? And so, if you wanted to make them tabbed like this, she sells the tabs. Donc, c'est vraiment un système que vous pouvez toujours changer. Elle a une pour toutes les markers. And it comes like a drawer. I know it's not that easy for me to, and I think it got put in backwards, but that's okay. Because you're supposed to be able to pull it out like a drawer. And each one of these, once you have it well formed, we just put this together dans deux secondes. Mais les huit sont comme des tiroirs, puis tu mets tes encres, tes mini encres dedans. So she designed this. Let's try this. She designed this to use for your mini ink pads, okay? So they will fit your mini ink pads, your distress, whatever, and you can put them all in here. Il y a huit tiroirs. Okay, so there's eight drawers. Dans, et ça vient aussi avec le tiroir, le gros tiroir, les huit petits tiroirs, et la paquet okay so that is all about getting organized the other things that she showed us that looked really cool was this one donc cela il reste sur ton um ta pupitre and i don't even have room to show you so maybe i'll be able to open one tomorrow to show you et cela est un sac un gros sac que ça, vous pouvez mettre dedans ou vous pouvez mettre quelques-uns de ceux-là. Donc, tu vas à, chez un ami pour faire de scrapbooking. Tu peux l'amener juste comme trois continents comme ça. Une gros puis quelques mini. Et ça fait très tout dans la gros tote ici qui a une base de 13 x 13 x 10 de haut. OK So, very, very cool. And I got it in purple, just because I had to, and black. Okay? Et sont 30 dollars, mais sont rigides, puis gros. Okay? So, really, really nice ones. So, that is all the arrangement. This one, as you see, it will sit on your, um, your counter. And what you would do, ce qu'elle a suggéré, c'est de remplir avec tout ce que vous allez utiliser pendant ton, ton temps de scrapbooking. Donc, si tu fais étamper beaucoup de choses ce jour, cette jour-là, mets tes encres, mets ton bone folder, puis comme ça, vous pouvez assembler. What is the weight limit for this bag? Um, I wonder if she put that. That's a good question, Pam. I'm not sure if she put that, but I will check with her or her site to know. Because she was like, put this in there, put that in there. And she said it was really, really a strong bag. 
So good question though. I will look into that and see if there's anywhere I can get that information. All right. Et ça dit qu'il y a 16 sections pour um, garder tous vos outils. Okay, so it really is, she does try to really think them out. This is what she calls her collection keepers. Puis elle avait des échantillons de ceux-là. Il fitrait dans le paper holder que nous autres en a. So we do have these paper holders in stock. So these are, ça garde ton collection ensemble. How do I explain it? Here you go. So you see what you get? Donc, vous pouvez mettre vos 12 12 là, puis les collants, les éphémères et tout ça ensemble. Really, really, they are great, great products and everything holds a lot. Okay, so now that I've shown you that, let's go on to some product here. First of all, look what's back in stock. We've got our stencil mat. Okay, waffle flower stencil mats. Somebody had a special order for one. And these are the few extras that we've got. Okay, so voila. It's, uh, je pense c'est fait en silicone. Puis je vais vous dire que la monde qui l'ont acheté m'a dit qu'il aime bien, bien, bien son uh, achat. Et il vient dedans, il vient aussi dans un sac pour le pr protéger. So it also comes in its own bag inside, and it's got a zip closure. So really, really cool, okay? So we have that. I'm gonna do that in a moment. Okay, these are some flowers. They're not new, mais il va aller avec les collections qui s'en vient au mois de février. Mais comme il était pas nouveau, nouveau, il n'y avait pas une façon que je dis au euh, centre distribution, garde ça jusqu'au temps que mes autres produits viennent. So, um, these are some of the flowers that are going to match the two new lines that are coming in. All right. And the distribution center wasn't going to hold everybody's flowers just to wait for the paper in February. So, just in case you're wondering, these flowers will go with those 249 and market lines that you're all waiting for. Okay? Crocodile. Well, crocodile seem to be back in style. Donc c'est juste ça fait poinçonner deux formats de trou. So this can make two different size holes. Et si vous avez jamais utilisé un crocodile comme ça ou comme ça Ils sont forts. Donc, il peut même faire percer les trous dans le cuir et dans le métal. So, this can, write, can also punch in leather and in metal. And literally, you squeeze it. It's like you're punching into butter. And then over here, what were you asking? You don't understand what the stencil mat does? Go look at a video. But it's really... Um, so you can do your stenciling. There's a sharp corner, a sharp edge for you to put your stencil. Um, because of the uh, texture of it, even when you're inking, you're not losing any of that ink because you can start off the mat and drag it onto your stencil. Mais vraiment, Waffle Flower, ils ont fait une très bonne vidéo à part de la stencil mat. Et je vais vous dire que la dernière fois qu'on l'a eu, il était tout Parti en 15 minutes après la vidéo. So you can color and stencil on top of it. Okay? So yes, back to the crocodile. You can punch the holes. You can also set eyelets. Eyelets seem to be creeping back into our, uh, into our world. Sur-là, ça coupe deux formats de... Ça arrondit, fait l'arrondissement de nos papiers. En deux formats. Ceux-là, c'est un petit, petit 3 mm. Puis ceux-là, c'est 9.5 mm. Donc, ça ouvre en haut. Let's see if you can see it here. Tu vois, ça ouvre en haut. Et dépendant laquelle côté de l'outil que tu utilises, ça dépend de laquelle format de arrondissement tu vas l'avoir. So, depending which side of the crocodile you use, 
that's how you'll know exactly what um, which size corner you're going to end up with. Okay, Jay, can you keep me uh, alert of the time? 4.42. Okay. All right, guys, I have another meeting at 5. So there, these are new colors. And the, when you see AB, AB, sur des bijoux comme ça, ça dit Aurora Borealis. C'est un traitement qui met sur les bijoux pour qu'ils brillent encore plus qui vous donne la look plus prisma, prisme, okay? So, um, whenever you see AB, it, it's a code in gems for Aurora Borealis, and it is a treatment that goes on these gems to actually make them more prismatic, okay? So, this one here, numéro 170, I don't know if they put a color, Mais tu l'as quatre formats sur le même paquet et c'est saphir. Cela, il s'appelle prism. I see a lot of blue and purple in it, but it is called prism. Very beautiful. Cela, c'est spectrum. So this has more of like a greeny, pinky undertone dans les lumières. Donc ça, c'est les reflets. I did not get Mama Elephant yet, but I... I'm not even sure if it's shipped, but it is on my way, on my way, on its way. Et voilà, aquamarine, okay? So these, I know, have been very popular. Stencil butter. We got some in packages of four. I had somebody ask about packages. So we have two packages of four. Um, this one is called Mardi Gras, and this one is called... Caribbean Sea or Caribbean Sea. Beautiful colors to use together. So very, very nice. Next, we'll do the doodlebug line all together. All together now. Spectrum Noir. So you know I took a class with them and I was going to go through the, the nine markers with you today, but that might have to wait till tomorrow. J'ai suivi un cours avec Spectrum Noir. Uh, pour l'introduction. Oh, these aren't the alcohol markers. I'm sorry, Leanne. I'm not sure if you're watching, but it seems the alcohol markers didn't make it here. These are the aqua markers. Okay? <clears throat> Donc, ça, c'est des paquets de Spectrum Noir Aqua. C'est un tricolore. Donc, il met trois couleurs dans le même crayon. Donc, tu vas avoir une crayon qui a ces trois couleurs-là, une autre qui a ces trois couleurs-là, puis ça. Si tu utilises sur de papier aquarelle, ça blend incroyable. OK? So, I did try these. I think I showed them to you last week. They work beautifully. So, you have <clears throat> nine colors in three pens, which is pretty cool. All right? So, let's see. Do they have names, Jay? Where are they? Oh, Great Outdoors. Okay. Great Outdoors pour celle-ci. Color Basics pour ceux-là. Uh, this one is Essentials Neutre. So here you have your neutrals. <clears throat> and here Floral Meadow. Okay. Pour faire beaucoup de fleurs. Au même temps, j'ai eu leur Metallic. Et ils sont vraiment métalliques. Donc, ça dit sur blanc et noir, ils marchent la même. So, you will see this on black and white paper. These are the colors. <coughs> so, you have gold. You have gold nugget, gold plate, burnished copper, antique bronze, pewter, and silver ingot. Okay. Donc, ça, c'est les six couleurs dans ce paquet qui s'appelle Métaux Précieux. <coughs> then, in this package, which is called Rare Minerals, that's where you have these yummy colors. Donc, on a une quartz rose, un grenat rouge, un citrine vert, and bronze, no, 
Can't be bronze antique. Jade. I'm not sure. Okay, jade green, blue topaz, and amethyst. Et sont toutes des couleurs métalliques. Tu vois le métallique? Ça va l'air comme ça, spécialement sur noir. <coughs> this is just a package of their ultra smooth white cardstock. People liked it very much in the class. Pour les marqueurs à base d'alcool et des choses comme ça. Donc, je les commandé. They are unscored, 8,5 par 11, 20 feuilles, 100 livres, puis vraiment, vraiment beau et blanc. Okay, so popular that way. Then we have the glitter markers, which I showed you, and again, I will go over them again, hopefully tomorrow. But here are your packages. Vibrant florals, sont à base d'eau, ils sont complètement pailletés. Ceux-là, c'est cool elements, donc des verts puis bleus. Et ceux-là, ça s'appelle les néons. So nice, bright, juicy colors, okay? So these are glitter markers, okay? They mark her. Ceux-là, c'est la peinture acrylique dans un marker. Et j'ai commandé juste un, un set de couleurs pour essayer. Et c'est les neutres. Ou les essentiels. So you've got a white, black, silver, and gold. I thought those were the best to try out. Donc c'est un paquet, la cat marker, 13,95. So I thought they were a good price. They have a tip 3 mm, so not terribly big. And I thought it would be fun to try those. Then we have the Spectrum Noir Sparkle. Pens, okay? These are glitter, sont pailletés, et sont des pinceaux. Look at this set. Okay, guys, don't even get me started on this one. Et vous pouvez les blender. Donc, vous pouvez faire du blending avec eux autres. So, this is like a light gray with a stunning blue and a dark gray kind of black. This must be exquisite, okay? I'm just saying... So this is called, this is called Tint and Tone, okay? So là, c'est Antique Vintage, puis ça, c'est les trois couleurs, Tint and Tone. Then we have Earthy Natural. This is for people who love glitter, and they go on like, tu sais le, le crayon de Wink of Stella? qui mettent les paillettes. Ceux-là, c'est la même chose, sauf avec la couleur. So this one is called Soft Pastels. This one here is all the metallics. So you have a silver, um, a silver, a gold, and it looks like a black metallic. And this one is Essential Brights. Et probablement, vous pouvez faire des mélanges de couleurs pour faire des autres teintures. Okay? So... Really nice, and they blend beautifully, okay? Then, I just got this in. I haven't tried it yet, but I really want to give it a try. I was told it was really strong and permanent. Uh, 22 mètres, donc 72 pieds. Et uh, je pense que vous pouvez le remplir. I think you can refill it, and it's $8.50. Stay tuned for a review on that. With deepest sympathy, it was just a small die, so I got it in because, like I said, we were missing sympathy dies. Anybody waiting for a stampendable? C'est pas un sombrero. It's not a sombrero. It's really for pour utiliser sur vo votre plateforme pour les étampes. Tu le fermes ton plateforme, puis au lieu de mettre nos mains pour le faire plus intense, on prend ça, puis comme ça, on peut mettre la pression égo, égale sur toute la plateforme. OK? So, these are very hot little products. They sell out very quickly. Uh, we've already sold probably like 100 of them, and now we just got back in 18, I believe, and... There's more coming.
Okay, last but never least, we'll go to our doodle bug. So this is a lots of love set. Chaque année, je sais jamais si on va avoir beaucoup de lignes de Saint-Valentin. Mais quand j'ai vu ceux-là, je trouve que oui, c'est Saint-Valentin, mais on peut l'utiliser pour des autres choses aussi, comme les petits nuages avec les cœurs qui tombent. Very good. Uh, flowers, I mean flowers. Les cœurs, vous pouvez mettre ça même in a lunchbox to one of your kids. Donc, vraiment utilisable comme motif. So, I found beautiful, beautiful patterns. Et comme toujours, on a une feuille de découpe ou de collant en arrière. Avec des mots, avec des bordures. Donc, tout ça. OK, so that's a week. Sont des collants. Ça, c'est les unités, dans, euh, les unis, excuse-moi. Ça, c'est texturé, les cartons texturés comme de basil, mais c'est vraiment les couleurs qui matchent exactement à le ligne. OK? And it is still a textured paper. Donc, vous avez 12 feuilles dedans. OK? And aussi, il fait toujours un petit print. Et eux autres sont des motifs plus petits, teinte sur teinte. So these are always tone on tone kind of subtle patterns that are great for backgrounds and always usable and still small enough for card makers. Okay? Donc sont aussi assez petits pour faire des cartes avec. So there's that. Oui, on a eu le 6 6 so we got the six by six pad, of course. These papers, I don't know if I can open it because I do have a meeting shortly. If Jay were here, but he's very busy picking an order. Okay, hang on guys, he's not here. Here we go. So these are the different beautiful patterns in there and colors. Okay, look how cute. They are always so cute, Doodlebug. Okay, les étiquettes, toujours pratique. Voilà, we have journaling cards. You have these little, uh, that could fit also on ATCs. Very, very cute patterns, little tags. Okay, look at those little tags just on little gifts. Donc vraiment une ligne très spéciale. On a les journal bits, donc c'est les bits and pieces. Donc, ça va avoir toutes ces fleurs-là et des cœurs et les étiquettes. So, you have tags and everything. Thank you, Linda. Here, we've got chit-chat. Okay, chit-chat. So, that has all the sentiments and stuff. Et là, on a l'éphémère. Donc, uh, et plus... Plus ou moins euh, bilingue parce qu'il n'y a pas beaucoup qui mettent des, euh, des souhaits dedans. Il y a une bannière, c'est tout. So these are so cute, very, very cute. Then we have the icon sticker sheet. The icon sticker sheet. Okay, again, bilingue parce qu'il n'y a pas de mots dessus. XOXO est bilingue. So, very, very cute. Après ça, on a les mini icons. Donc, sont plus petits encore. Et il y a trois feuilles différentes. Oh, non, deux feuilles différentes, excuse-moi. Deux feuilles complètement différentes dans le paquet. And these are, they say perfect for planners and calendars. These are a little bit more clear, I think. They used to be. Now it looks like they're white. Quand on a fait notre version de planificateur, il était plus, um, uh, plus clair, eux autres. All right, and then their doodle pops are always so sweet. Les petits coccinelles, les cœurs, ils sont faits comme des enamels, so they're made like enamel hearts. La boîte de poste, look at that post box with those little letters. Oh my goodness. This is what a telephone looked like, Victoria. 
Avant le cellulaire, ça a l'air comme ça, les téléphones. So, this is what a real telephone looks like, guys. Then we've got this one, the Shaker Pop. That looks like a frappuccino or a hot chocolate. They call it sweet tea. Donc, c'est bubble tea. Bubble tea, new rage. This one, I cornered the market on. Okay. Donc, comme je fais mes commandes uh, à 3 heures de matin, au lieu de commander 12, j'ai commandé 72. So, um, you all need one. Okay, it's called Love Note, and you guys just keep buying them. Parce que j'ai commandé, I bought 72 instead of 12. Don't ask. Then we've got a TV, the television. Yeah, you're laughing. I wish I was joking. Voilà, la télévision est comme un shaker aussi. And that one is called Telly Time. And then I love their shape sprinkles. Je sais qu'ils sont dispendus 6,95, mais c'est toujours, toujours, toujours le morceau, le, ma préférence dans toutes les lignes. I love these little enamels. I just do. I don't care what the price. I love the enamels. Okay? So this one is called Lots of Love. Après ça, on a des petits cœurs avec des visages. So, definitely cute. Look at this. Les nuages, les arc-en-ciel. I mean, these are called love is in the air. I just love these. Voilà, bright bouquet. Okay. Loving, loving, loving all of these. And then these are popular every year. Love you more. Et c'est les petits cœurs. Et vous avez deux, quatre, six, uh, douze, quinze, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seventy, cent cinq petits cœurs dessus. Okay? So it looks like you have a hundred. Actually, you have more than that because that's another. T'as cent douze. It says ninety-eight. It doesn't make sense that it's ninety-eight. Okay, cinq, dix, puis quatre. Okay, quatorze fois sept. So then... It is 98. Sorry, guys. All right. So that is everything for today. Okay. That's everything for today. Demain, je vais retourner avec vous à 4 heures encore. Les boîtes mystères sont toutes vendues. And um, what else? That's it. Until tomorrow. We will talk about the ATCs tomorrow. I think there was a little confusion on the site, okay? So, tomorrow, uh, we'll, we'll clarify. Donc, si vous avez des questions, rien, écris-le, puis demain, tu peux me demander, okay? Um, oh, yes. Okay, so that'll take 72. You're right. So if everybody does me an ATC card with those envelopes on it, I should get rid of my 72, no problem. So thank you guys. I have to jump into a meeting with Graphic 45, but um, je vais être de retour demain à 4 heures. Allez prendre, faire des achats. Moi, je vous garantis que tu vas aimer les, les marqueurs. Moi, j'ai été surprise de l'avoir aimé tant que ça. Et les aquarelles, ils marchent très bien aussi, juste pour vous dire, parce que je suis maniaque de mon aquarelle, OK? All right, guys, so um, we'll see you tomorrow at 4 o'clock. And if you have any questions about the ATCs, I promise to clarify that all tomorrow, OK? So, à demain. Je t'aime. Bye. Love you guys.